Hi guys, it's Katie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming the third update for my 2021 Rolling Project 10 Pan. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. Okay guys, I have a really good update this time. I finished a lot of products and I have a, not, a lot of new roll-ins, so definitely stay tuned. The first product that I was working on is this Too Faced foundation. And I wanted to use it at least 15 times. I actually only used it eight times and it is completely gone. It still looks like there's a little bit left, but nothing will come out. So I'm really excited to have finished this and I will actually be rolling in another foundation. So definitely stay tuned for that. The next product I was working on is my Too Faced Hangover RX Primer. I wanted to use this at least 15 times. Um, I only got eight more uses out of this before it was done and I actually cut it open to get every last bit out. And again, I really enjoyed using this, but I'm excited to have finished this one too. The next product is my L'Oreal Lumi Setting Mist. And I wanted to use it 15 times and I used it 16 times and this one is completely done. I think I started the project at this line and this was my second update and then this was my last one. I think these first two lines were from last year. But again, I really did enjoy this. Um, I would maybe consider repurchasing this in the future, but I'm glad to have this one done too. The next product I am working on is my Becca powder. And I wanted to use this 20 times and I used it 28 times. This is just a mini of their loose setting powder. And I have lines on the back, but again, I didn't really, I can't really draw new lines this time. So I didn't. I seem to be able to draw lines after like every other update. So yeah, I'm not sure. This is taking forever. I really mostly only use it to set my under eyes. I use a very little amount. So honestly, this could take the whole year, <laughs> but I'm still using this. And um, next time I would like to use it at least 20 times again. The next product I am working on is my Wet n Wild Blush. This one is in the color Rose Champagne. And I wanted to use it at least 10 times and I used it 12. It looks no different than it did before. I don't even know if I can hit pan on this by the end of the year, but I'm still really enjoying using it. So I'm just gonna keep plugging away on this. And next time I want to use this one at least 12 times. The next product is my Natasha Denona Highlight, and it's the Super Glow one in the shade 01 Fair. And I wanted to use this one 15 times, and I actually used it 19. It does have like a dip going in the middle. Not a lot, but a little tiny dip. Again, this is something that's gonna probably take all year and even then I'm not even confident I'll hit pan on it. But again, it's something I'm really enjoying so I will keep working on this. The next product is my butter bronzer and I wanted to use it at least 20 times and I used it 24 times. And the pan is definitely expanding. It's actually starting to like break off product. So, I don't know, I might have to repress this soon, but I don't know, I don't really want to, so we will see. But I actually am going to switch this bronzer out for another one. This one is really light. It's the butter bronzer and it's the light shade, the light bronzer. So I wanna switch it out for something a little bit deeper for the rest of the spring and then to the summer. So I will be rolling this out. I might roll it back in um, in the fall or winter, we will see. But my goal was just to use this more and expand the pan and I definitely did do that. But I will be rolling this out for now. The next product I was working on is my Clinique Lip Liner. And I wanted to use this 20 times and I actually used it 21 and now it is completely gone. There is nothing left. 
this took me like all of last year and then up until now of this year so definitely like almost like I don't know a year and four months to finish this so you definitely get your money's worth out of that I think yeah here I have lines for it so this was the first update the uh this is the intro and the first update and I don't have a line for the second update um but anyway this is completely gone now that's how much I used and I really did enjoy it I might actually consider repurchasing this um this is in the shade bamboo 33 bamboo and it's just a perfect lip liner that you can wear with almost everything and I, I it lasts like a really long time so the next product is the NYX butter gloss mine is in the shade Madeline I, I really like this gloss and I wanted to use it 10 times and I used it 13 times and I am making some progress on this I didn't think I was but um, this was the last line I had I didn't draw a line last time but this time I'm down to here and my goal is to finish this but I still think this is going to take a while but next time I want to use that one at least let's see what did I write 15 times so yeah we will see but I really do enjoy this one so I will keep working on that and then the other thing I was working on is my Too Faced Sweet Peach palette and I was working on three shades and I want to hit pan on these sh three shades before the end of the year. The first shade I'm working on is Peaches and Cream and I wanted to use it at least 10 times. I used it 11 times and on the 11th use, I did finally hit pan, just a bitty pan, but I'm really excited to finally hit pan. It takes like, like a, at least 100 uses to hit pan on this. So yeah, you get a ton of product in this. The next shade um, I am working on is Luscious and I wanted to use this one at least seven times and I did. This one is not really close but I do have like a good dip in it and I want to use it at least seven times next month. So just slow and steady and hopefully by the end of the year I will have pan. And then the last shade I wanted to use five times and I actually used it six and it is Georgia and it is this light peach shade. And again, there is a good dip going in this one, but it could still take a while, who knows? But I am going to just keep working on the last two shades in this, and I still really enjoy those shades, and I really like this palette. And then lastly, I was working on this um, body mist. I wasn't counting my usage or, or anything, but this is Japanese Cherry Blossom from Bath and Body Works. And there is like a tiny bit left, you can see, but it doesn't really spray out very well. I'll probably try to still get the last drop out of this out, but as this project is concerned, I am done with this. And I will actually be rolling in a different fragrance to work on. So now let's get to all the products I am rolling in. There are quite a few. The first one is the new foundation that I want to work on, and it is the Physician's Formula Healthy Foundation. And I want to use this at least 15 times before the next update. And this is, doesn't have a lot left. I'm up right about here. So I'm not sure how long this will take, but I'm thinking maybe a couple of months. So we will see, but I would like to finish this. It's a, it's one of my favorite drugstore foundations and it is discontinued, which is really sad, but, um, you can still find it on Amazon and I probably will order this if I can find it after I finish this one. The next one I'm rolling in is to replace the primer I was working on. And this one is just like a deluxe size sample 
and it's the First Aid Beauty Coconut Skin Smoothing Priming Moisturizer. And I've used like another mini of this one before and I know I like it. So I want to finish this. And I want to use this one, I think at least 10 times before the next update. I'm not sure how many uses there are in here, but I think it's more than you would think. So I don't know, but I want to use this at least 10 times. The next product I am adding in is an eyeliner and pencil eyeliners take forever. I've used up, I project panned at least two, I think. Um, this is a nude one from Essence and um, I just use it on the waterline. This is how much is left. I've used quite a bit of this, but there's still like a lot left and it is getting older, but this is something I would repurchase. I really, really like this. It's just a nude color. So yeah, I just wanna work on this. I don't really think I can finish this by the end of the year, cause eyeliners are just so slow and there is so much of this left, but we shall see. And I want to use that one at least 10 times before the next update. Then I am rolling in a lip liner to replace the one I finished up. And this is all that is left. So I would like to finish this. This will still take a really long time though. <laughs> and this is ColourPop Skimpy. And again, I want to use this at least 10 times before the next update. This is all that is left. And I did mark it, but it actually comes out. So you can literally see that's how much I have left of this. But again, this will take quite a few uses to finish. But then we'll have to see when it stops sharpening too. So I might not actually be able to finish the whole entire thing because this is very tiny. <laughs> but I really, really like this lip liner. It's a really nice nude. So I am adding that in. And then let's see, lastly, um, I'm adding in this bronzer from Clinique. And this is their bronzer in O2 Sunkissed. And I already have pan on this one too. But this is a really nice summer shade for me. So again, I just want to get more use out of it and maybe expand the pan. I think maybe what my goal will be is to start trying to expand the area right here. So you can see the whole first ring of um, the pan. So yeah, we will see. And then maybe if I hit that goal, I'll try to expose the whole second ring. It's pretty thin down here on this side, but on this side of the pan, it's thicker. So we will see there's still a lot of product left and I still love this bronzer. And then lastly, I am adding in a fragrance and this is Marc Jacobs Daisy Oh So Fresh. And I have this ginormous bottle. I think it's like 4.2 fluid ounce, but this is my signature scent. I love it and I really don't ever get sick of it. Um, but yeah, this, is, this bottle is gonna take forever to finish. So I just want to work on it. I want, I'm not gonna mark it cause I don't wanna like ruin this gorgeous bottle, but I want to at least get down to the top of the word daisy. And then maybe if I hit that, I'll work to getting to the bottom of the word Daisy and then the bottom of uh, the word Mark Jacobs. So we will see. I want to use this one at least 20 times before the next update. So that is the end of this video. Um, I had a really good update and I'm really excited to be adding in like six new products to work on to keep it fresh. And I'm really happy to continue to work on the products that have been in from the beginning too. A lot of them are very slow going, but that's okay. So yeah, if you guys like beauty videos and project pans, make sure you give this video a like and consider subscribing so you can see my next update. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.